Shalom God people, we are back again to share with you what the Lord has shown us, we are in a world that require the Holy Spirit to work in us, as written in the book of Joel, in the last days, God says, I will pour out my Spirit on all people. Your sons and daughters will prophesy, your young men will see visions, your old men will dream dreams. It is time for us brothers to kneel down and be filled with the Spirit of God that will show us what we don't know, the Bible say call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things, which thou knowest not, beloved we don't know the nature of this world, there are things happening around us, we don't see them, these are dreadful realities that if the Lord was to reveal to us we will not want to continue life here, it is because of these things that we don't see that the Lord fight for us and spare us, I want to share about the gravity of buying things in shop and supermarket and eating them without praying first, as a result the believers suffer consequence in many aspect of their lives, in the end of time the Lord is revealing mysteries to the saint because of his grace, call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things, which thou knowest not. I was sleeping and the Lord opened my eyes, I began to see nocturnal vision, in which I was walking in the street, as I was moving my spiritual eyes open and I began to see wicked spirit walking the street, brother these things were dreadful to behold, I saw entities that live with us on the earth that we don't see, I was shocked to see demon and wicked spirit that walk the earth, brother what shocked me was the huge population of demon in the human world, deployed to the earth by the enemy, the numbers of wicked spirit in this planet was far exceeding the human population, the human world is overpopulated with demon of all kind, brother we are surrounded by demons sent by the devil for the end time missions, we are infiltrated to a level you would not imagine, I saw people that were half human half animal, they had human body but heads of animal, they have human face but body of animals, they were walking the land among us, they live with us but we don't see them, often you walk the street and see a man passing but in reality he is not a man he is a demon that is human envelope, the Lord opened the chest of many people and I saw that they were demon, other were witches, I was walking the street, I saw a bus station where there were people waiting for the bus, among them I saw five people that came back from work, they were waiting for the bus and having chat, however, I saw that three of these five people were demon, and two of them were normal human, however these three demons were in the appearance of human, because they were covered by human skin, these five co-workers were talking and laughing about the work, but three were demon, the two that were human did not know that three of their colleagues were demon, they thought these were just co-workers, just imagine some of your schoolmate were demon and that your co-workers with whom you spend the day in the work environment are demon, yet you talk and eat together but they are demon, brother you may have a colleague that you think you know very well, because you know his address, you know his wife and children and parent, and you think he is a human, but he is a demon, that was sent to earth to carry out a mission, it is true that he was born and grew up like any other child, but he is a demon, and there are many of them, therefore don't be quick to talk about your life, these co-workers and schoolmate that are demons can be kind, they can be Christian, I was walking in this encounter, the Lord led me to a bakery, where they were selling break and cakes, oh my brother what I saw in that bakery may the Lord keep us, what are we really eating in this world this evil world, often we are happy when we buy these veggs or meat, but what I saw beloved it is terrible, when I look at bread and cakes that were on the shelves, I saw that some cake had human mouth, other had human eyes moving and looking at the people, other cakes were human head, people bought them like that and they went to eat thinking that they bought normal cake, I saw a cake speaking, to my surprise the cake that was closer to me was shedding tears, this is because I was not supposed to be in this place, and I was closer to it, then I saw a man entering this bakery, he had the body of a human but the head of a crocodile's, when there was eyes contact between me and him he was stunned, and began to shake his head left and right, he acted like when a monkey is angry, there was anger in his face he was moving his head left and right, in fact he was not happy to see me in the bakery because he came to work, I look at him and I said be quiet in the name of Jesus Christ, as a result he became immobilized, in the meantime there were cakes talking, watching and crying as people were entering the bakery to beauty, 
Beloved people are eating demon that will stay in the body, foods is destroying prey life of the believers, the spiritual life of the saint that is based on prayer and Bible reading is affected by food, and because of food, when you want to pray you will begin to feel extremely heavy, and during prayer your mind is invaded by all kind of thoughts, you can't even read the word, because of these food that have demon. These food are destroying our prayer life and we are unable to read the Bible, there were demons everywhere in the street, today the believers leave home without prayer. They say they are rushing, understand that when you leave home and walk the street, boulevard and roundabout, you have enter another world, full of demons walking the street, and since you fail to pray they will see that you went out of home without prayer, and they can shoot you with arrow, they can send sickness cause mischief in your life, they can block aspect of your life, often people lust after women in the street not knowing that she could be a demon, that have dressed indecently, she came to earth with a body of good shape and a beautiful face, to cause men to lust after her, and the moment you lust after her demons would enter in your body, we are in the world but not of this world, the more we approach the rapture and the end of the world new category of demon are being released on the land. The enemy objective is the children of God, he want to stop to us from rising in the rapture, he want us to live in distraction, so that we won't hear the voice of the trumpet, the world is corrupt, we must cease to be like animal men, we cannot leave homes without prayer.